Call it double celebration and you will not be wrong. Ambassador Lao Abdullahi Kazore, the state's chief of protocol to President Muhammad Buhari, is the newly to band Damasanin Kazore. He makes his way into the breathtaking State House Banquet Hall where he's been fitted. Seven and past ministers, captains of industry, members of the diplomatic corps, friends and family are gathered here at this grand reception to celebrate his tabanin as well as the wedding of his only daughter Hafsa to her husband Ibrahim. The Daman Sanin Kazore, who doubles as the principal gatekeeper to President Buhari, means different things to different people. He's been described as a diplomat per excellence by some, while to others he's a dedicated worker who has contributed immensely to national development, and above all, a loving father. He is a great patriot of unalloyed loyalty. A simple and easygoing person, but also a great achiever who is detrabalized, very respective and open-minded. He started as a journalist, and he met me in the newsroom as a rookie reporter. And that's more than, I must say, I guess 36 years. <laughs> and then, we were the first three set of officials that President Buhari appointed after his inauguration. Myself, Femi Adeshina, and Ambassador Masada Kazauri. So that's the record we also hold. Let me say that this is the third owner he's getting in three months. We are in Niger, he's got the national owner there. The president gave him OFR and we went to his home in Kazauri and he gave him Dammaseni. Dammaseni is not your is not your regular title, ordinary kind of thing. It's for choosing few. I'm sure many people here know who Dammaseni Kano Machamasile was. They look people who have made staggering contributions to community development and to the development of the nation. I'm proud of you for many reasons that I cannot mention here. You have accomplished all sorts of things in your life. And I have no doubt that you will have several more successes around the corner. You have done an incredible job of raising us. Thank you all that you have given me. My dad is one of the best dads in the world. He has and will always take care of me. He has the utmost respect for me and my decisions. And that is why I have so much respect for him. Many of the dignitaries who graced the occasion, including President of Dangote Group of Companies, Minister of Justice and Attorney General of the Federation, and Chairman of the Nigerians and Diaspora Commission, described the conferment of the traditional title on Ambassador Kazore as deserving. I would like to His congratulate Excellency, uh, His Excellency Ambassador as the Damasani uh, Kazore. Uh, he's a very, very He's a gentleman, he's a Ibrahim great Gamari, person, who is here, and that's why we're all here to uh, celebrate Cross. with him. And I wish him all the very best. He is someone whose services, contributions, and it is support to the development of the nation are being recognized both at the locality and internationally. You can see the caliber of people, local and international, that are here to grace the occasion. We are happy for him, we are happy for the family, and we pray to Almighty Allah to grant him additional successes in life. He has one of those rare qualities, quiet, calm, efficient, always with a smile. You know, I know that I've, 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 <laughs> I've been a, prop, a thorn in his flesh <laughs> a number of times, you know, but that is cool for you. Ambassador Kazari, and, and I'm not surprised that this honor being done to him by uh, Kazari community, highly deserved, and then a, a wedding too. He's just a, a great guy. President Buhari, who is represented by his chief of staff, Professor Ibrahim Gambari, also pays glowing tribute to his protocol chief with a personally signed congratulatory message delivered. I'm very pleased that one of my principal aides is deemed worthy to be honored by the Emir of Kazari and the good people of his Emirates. I also wish to take this opportunity to thank you immensely for your services as my state chief of protocol over the past seven and a half years. Ambassador Kazori, while expressing gratitude, 
promises to remain steadfast in what he does for the people of Kazoro Emirate and the nation. Uh, I'm overwhelmed by what has happened this evening and what happened yesterday when I was stubborn by His Royal Highness Zainia of Kazori. I feel elated and uh, the recognition of my little contribution for the development of the Emirate in general and the Kadore town in particular so I can assure you I can assure them that whatever opportunity that I have I'm ready to serve them and serve the nation also his only daughter is sharing the spotlight with her father here guests and family members offer words of encouragement for the newlywed and her spouse I'm so happy for them uh, and my and advice for them is to stay blessed and then they should trust each other, be honest to all each other, and they shouldn't allow any third party. And for the bride, have said our jewel, our heart, our pride. I have no doubt that she would have a successful marriage, inshallah. She has learned from the best. Hafsad is amazing. She's one of a kind, one once in a lifetime kind of wife that Mubarak would ever, you know, dream of. What's a wedding reception without the first dance? The couple were thrilled to a live performance by one of Nigeria's finest musicians, Timi Dakolu. For Ambassador Kazore and his family, it's been a long journey of service to the nation and they are full of gratitude to all Nigerians who turned out in their numbers to share in their joy. Adesua, Omoruan, Arise News.